Uh, yeah, we swung the bats extremely well. You know, one of our better uh, offensive outputs of the year. And um, you know, I think one of the key things that, that I liked as a coach was we were using the whole field. We were going backside, um, you know, on the outside pitches, pulling the inside pitches. Uh, it wasn't just up there hacking and free swinging. That we actually looked like we had an approach, we had a plan. Uh, we put a lot of effort into batting practice today, and I'm happy with the results. And uh, yeah, we had you know, some guys that have been in some slumps the last couple of weeks uh, had had good outings tonight. Okay. And obviously, that was uh, complimented by uh, Brigman's outing on the mound. Only allowed the one hit was really dominant in you know, most of the game. So. Yeah. Christian was outstanding. He's that typical crafty lefty, uh, hides the ball well, and it just jumps at you. Uh, he's not going to light up the radar gun, but he's smart. He's got a high IQ on the mound, and he can throw three or four pitches for strikes whenever he wants to. And I uh, was really proud of him tonight. And um, you know, uh, he, he was uh, uh, he was outstanding through strike. And this, that's what we talked about. We, we emphasized with him tonight was throw strikes, let your defense work behind you, and have confidence, and get them to you know roll over on some pitches and hit some pop ups and mix in a couple strikes out strikeouts. And, and he was great. Okay, Marcus Nettles obviously uh, carries into the uh, Palmetto. Uh, Legion, just talk a little bit about that and just tell me what you're expecting kind of this weekend. Yeah, we're excited. It's uh, st an event that we started back in, I think, 2012. So we're on our 10th year of the event. And it's really just to get a bunch of teams from around the country to come together uh, and play teams you normally never would play. And that's how it started uh, that first year. We had about five teams and we went over to Coastal Carolina and expanded from there. Last year, uh, COVID took a hit on us. and couldn't travel. Uh, this year, the amount of teams is reduced. Usually we'll get 24, 25 teams uh, participating. Uh, COVID with the travel has still been tough on us, um, but we've only got our site and then uh, one site at, at the beach at Socasty uh, with eight teams. It'll be still be a fun event and uh, we look forward to it. We've got three tough teams from Ohio and, uh, and Chesterfield who we played in a scrimmage earlier this year. So it'll be four really good games. And for fans, it starts tomorrow night with uh, Chesterfield and uh, Greenville, Ohio. And then uh, all games all day Saturday and all day Sunday. So good opportunity to watch some baseball. Hope for less than good weather.